Hi, hello, welcome back to Max Ninja. I hope you all have gone through the introduction part of our chapter. Those who haven't, I will give the link in the description box. So please go through. Today we can discuss question number 1 and 2 of the exercise, exercise 7.1. First section is filling the blanks. Two line segments are congruent. If one condition we should fill with a condition. See I have bought two line segments and if we keep one over the other both will match. That means these two lines are congruent. So both are having same length. Isn't it? So here I can write down both are having same length. If two line segments are congruent, if they have same length. Question number B. Among two congruent angles, one has a measure of 70 degree. The measure of the other angle. See? Two angles I have bought. If we keep one angle over the other, it matches exactly and its measure is 70 degree. So one angle is 70 degree means other angle is also 70 degree. So answer is 70 degree. When we write angle A equal to angle B, B actually means, what is the meaning of angle A equal to angle B? See, this is angle A and if we are measuring, we will be getting 70 degree. That means measure of angle is 70 degree. So instead of angle A, I can write down measure of angle A. Measure of angle B, A means after measuring angle A we will be getting one answer. So measure of angle A equal to measure of angle B. Instead of this measure of angle A equal to measure of angle B I can write angle A equal to angle B. Both are having same meaning. Question number two. Give any two real life examples for our congruent shape. Now we are going to find out some examples for congruency from our real life. See, these two shapes are congruent. Next, so these two are congruent by both are having same size and shape. Two pen. Does the color have any role in the congruency? No. Both are having same size and shape. So both are congruent. See. These two shapes are also congruent. See. Next example. These two are congruent. Now. As a homework. You just observe the congruent shapes in your surrounding. Okay. I hope you have enjoyed my class. If you have any doubt about this topic, please ask to me through comment box. If you like my video, please like, share and subscribe and support me. Signing off, Amy Bijoy from Max Ninjas.